Hi there family, from Monique and I, and on behalf of Christ's Heartbeat Ministries International, as well as each of our daughter ministries, we would just like to take this opportunity today to wish you and your family a very happy, happy new year. year. Family, as the old year goes out and as the new year comes in, we would just like to reflect on the previous year and thank you for your continued love and support throughout the course of 2022. Without you, it would not have been possible for us to accomplish what the Lord has accomplished through this ministry over the course of 2022. And as we proceed into 2023, we would like to take a look at the Hebrew calendar and what the meaning thereof is for the year 2023 and encourage you from that. The family, the year 2023 means Gimal, which is um, a year of prosperity, walking into God's favor. And family, as you walk in God's favor and as you, as He blesses you and He provides for you in times of need and as He brings revival unexpectedly, we trust and believe that He will provide all your needs. And as He provides yours, that you will also take care of those around you, blessed to be a blessing. But further is also the year of the reward of the wicked, meaning where God reckons with those that have done wrong. So we want to encourage you to draw closer to God, draw closer to His presence, let Him love on you and love God. Show God how much you love Him, how much He is our Heavenly Father, because He cares for us so much and He just needs us to draw close to Him. He says, seek first the kingdom of God. Amen, family. And with that said about loving God, I'm a reminder of the scripture from 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9, which reads, No eye has seen, no ear has heard, and no mind has imagined what God has prepared for those who love Him. Family, with that said, when we take a look back at 2022, 2022 was the year where the Lord was beginning something new. And 2023 is where he's expanding on that and growing on that and taking that to new levels and to new heights. I've spoken to numerous prophetic people who have said this is going to be a supernatural year, 2023. And I want to encourage you to take that scripture, 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9. Take that as a prophetic declaration for the year that no eye has seen, no ear has heard, no mind has imagined or perceived what God has prepared for those who love Him. But the key to unlocking that and unleashing that into your 2023 is the last piece where it says there, for those who love Him. In other words, those who love God are the only ones who are going to be able to access what no eye has seen, no ear has heard, and no mind has imagined. And that is our responsibility as Christians to love on God. The greatest commandment is to love the Lord our God. And an equal one to that is to love one another as we love ourselves. We are commanded to love the royal law of love. Why, family? Because God is love. So when we love on God, when we seek God, when we pursue God, when we pursue His perfect plan, will, purpose, and path for our lives, we will unleash and unlock into our youth what no eye has seen, what no ear has heard, and what we could never, even in our wildest dreams, imagine what is possible. As we pursue God, He will reveal these things to us. He will unleash these things to us, and He will guide us into His perfect will for our lives, which is better than what we could ever imagine. And He will take us from strength to strength, from glory to glory, and from victory to victory. As we, as Monique said, seek first the kingdom of God. That is key, family. Matthew 6, 33, seek first the kingdom of God and His righteousness above all else. And the New Living Translation says, and He will give you everything that you need. So we want to encourage you, family, as we go into the year 2023, to continue to pursue God, to continue to pursue His will for your life and do what He asks you to do and watch how He will take you from strength to strength, from glory to glory and from victory to victory in every area of your life. But the key is to love Him and to pursue Him and watch what He will do, family. Family, as a ministry, we've got some really exciting things for the year ahead. The Lord has started revealing things to us, and we are really excited for what He's going to do in us, through us, and for us in the year ahead. So we'd like to encourage you to please go and like, follow, and subscribe to all of our social media accounts so that you can be kept up to date and in the loop with everything that the Lord is doing in the ministry in the year ahead. Alternatively, you can also go and check out our website, www.christsheartbeat.org. 
and family. We trust that you will enjoy your day with family and friends and just have, as you go into the new year with an open heart, a clean heart, a good heart, that the year will just be an awesome year at the end of the year. And we just pray that God will bless you and keep you safe. Amen. Thank you, family. Enjoy the rest of your day. All the best for the year ahead and God, God. bless.